Hast du hier Tommys gesehen, Kurt? Irgendwo hat sich einer versteckt. Den erwischen wir schon. Was machst du denn, Kurt? Gleich nur uns hinter der Kiste. Wenn du irgendwelche Tommy siehst, dann sag es uns. Ich glaube, da hinten war was. Da, da hinten. Hey, Kurt, gib mal den Balken hoch. Ich muss da durch. I tried to save him. He tried to save me. But I failed. Man, wake up! Come with me. We don't got much time. You transfer out tomorrow, right? Well, this is your last chance to get your camera back. Come on. A prisoner of war. A phrase I'd never have understood back home in Canada. But there I was. Four months into a stretch, at the pleasure of the German army. I was to be transferred out to the country. I'll never forget that last day. They'd taken my notebook, my camera. This was my last chance to get them back. Come on, Harry. So, on cleaning duty this morning, I went through all their cupboards. I got your camera, your notebook, and anything else with your name on. I stashed it all together. 
It's ready to go. Listen, I'm on a break, but they got me cleaning the guard block again. You know what that means? Today's the day, Birdman. Shift starts again soon, and there's only one guard right now. Come on. Come on, Harry. Okay, Birdman, time to do your thing. Wait until I'm inside. You distract the Fritz, and I'll get your stuff. I'll meet you out back. I've already stashed your things. I just need a distraction, like we discussed, right? Come on, Julian. Blöde Gefangene. Jemand sollte sie alle erschießen. Alle. Psst, come here. Hurry, quick. Here's your stuff. Go hide it in your bunk before anyone sees. I had to hide them. A stack of letters. Months worth. The guards have been holding all of our mail. Now you'd think, that many letters from Julia, I'd have torn them open. But if I got caught, I'd never get out. I had to hide them. It was torture. Du, Gefangener! Weg von dem Zaun oder ich schieße! Weitergehen. Du hast hier nichts verloren. Kein Zutritt. Here's your stuff. Go hide it in your bunk before anyone sees. I had to hide them. A stack of letters. Months worth. The guards have been holding all of our mail. Now you'd think that many letters from Julia. I'd have torn them open. But if I got caught, I'd never get out. I had to hide them. It was torture. Weg von dem Zaun oder ich schieße! I'd also forgotten that Kurt had given me his address, back in Vimy. He lived on a farm, and I was due to be transferred out to the country. It gave me an idea, and I knew just the man who could help. Yes. Dear Katrin, Four months of asking and still they do not grant my leave. All that is left is my duty now. I wake some mornings forgetting why I came here in the first place. The only thing that keeps me going, the only light I see are these letters home to you and our darling daughter. The weather here has turned a lot colder. I ride surrounded by snow. Please tell Lucy.
So I had Kurt's address and was to be transferred to the country the next day. If anyone knew how to change a movement order, it would be my friend Julian. Change the address on your movement orders? Impossible. You're crazy. You can try, but it's your funeral, Birdman. Follow me. Right in the cabinet at the back. But that's the officer's quarters. You're not getting in there without a damn good distraction. Soccer. I hadn't played since I was at school. I hated sports. I was never any good at them. But for my plan, I didn't need to be. Well, no more football for us. Our ball's stuck on the roof. I can't believe it, Harry. Thank you so much. You want to play? Come on. Okay, wait until I'm ready, and then shoot. <laughs> One lucky kick was all I needed, and I got it. That ball was my way in. Jeden Tag immer das Gleiche. Verfluchter Krieg. I was on the train before I had the chance to finally read Julia's letters. I was so distracted. I didn't even care if I was going to Kurt's farm or not. My heart was pounding. Dear Harry, thank you for all the wonderful photos you send to me. I received no reply from my last letter. Please write back. My dearest Harry, I will not believe harm has come to you. I cannot bear the thought of a world without you in it. I love you, Julia. And for the first time, those letters carried the scent of her sweet, sweet perfume. I had to get home. It had been nearly a year since I had seen my home, since I had seen my family. I could not sleep. At home I dreamt of war, 
At war, I dreamt of home. I wasn't going home. Not yet, anyway. But I did have my camera back. To most on the Allied side, Germany was a machine, efficient and relentless. But there were people starving on that train, people that needed help. Ich habe solchen Hunger. Hast du diesen Wagen nichts verloren gefangen? Raus hier! I remember a carriage of wounded German soldiers. Some gestured to me for food. I wasn't the hero Julia thought I was. I couldn't help these people. But I could take photos. One day, I thought, when I'm back in Canada, I'll show people what happened. And as I took those photos, I wondered, had my plan to get to Kurt's farm even worked? I had ten days at home and barely knew where to begin. I knew only that Luzi needed me. I could not even bring myself to enter my son's room. Deutsche Katze, Papa? Was hat sie in Frankreich gemacht? Meinst du, ich kann auch mal in den Krieg, Papa? Ich will auch gegen den Feind kämpfen. Wie du? Wenn wir den Krieg gewinnen, 
gibt es dann wieder Essen? Ich möchte eine große Scheibe, Papa. Es tut mir leid, Liebes. Dieses Stück Brot muss lange reichen. Was hältst du von dem Namen Lotti, Papa? Passt er zu ihr? Mama hat gesagt, du hättest im Schlaf geschrien. Ist alles in Ordnung? Warst du immer noch an der Flugmaschine? Danke, Papa. Du hast mir gefehlt. Guten Morgen, Kurt. Ich habe Dr. Siegfrieds Stethoskop aus dem Dorf mitgebracht. Für Luzi. Luzi, hast du dein Brot gegessen? Wir brauchen Feuerholz, Kurt. Oh, wir brauchen frisches Wasser aus dem Brunnen, Kurt. Holst du bitte etwas? Things were different at home. Weird. We have all changed up here. Maybe it was Lucy's illness. Maybe it was the war. But I never mentioned Max, for I could not speak of my failure. I remember that little girl so clearly. She was alone. She was hungry. I couldn't just leave her. Maybe the adults on board could spare a little food. chocolate belong to they'd be happy to feed a starving child or that's what I told myself anyway For some reason, it reminded me of the man whose life I the accidentally, man I accidentally sent Allied intelligence to. The German and his cat.
Lotti, Lotti. Lauf, Lotti, lauf. Hier, Lotti. Was machst du hier, Lotti? I did what I could, but Lucy remained ill. Oh, Lucy, alles in Ordnung? Kurt! I wish I knew how to help my little girl. I came home to see my wife and my daughter, to spend time with my family, and yet none of us spoke. I thought I could come home from the war. I thought I could leave it behind. But I understand now, Katrin, and I'm sorry. I can never leave the war behind. The war follows me wherever I go. Sure enough, I found myself on Kurt's doorstep. I didn't know how he'd react. It's one thing being friends with the enemy in a tunnel underground, but another being friends out in the open. I needn't have worried, though. Kurt and his family were kind to me. They took me in, gave me a bed to sleep in, cooked me meals. In return, I helped out on the farm and did what I could around the house. A few days later, Kurt took me to a nearby village. There were things his family needed. Lucy, his daughter, was sick. And Germany was struggling to feed itself by that time. Everyone was hungry. So while I looked for food, Kurt looked for medicine for his little girl. Kurt trusted me with one of his ration tickets but people weren't too friendly. Nicht für dich. Geh weiter abschauen. Hey. Geh weg. Geh weg! Raus aus meinem Garten! Oh. 
Wir nehmen heute keine Patienten auf. Essensmarke? Wir haben noch ein Leid. Nur für Sie. I finally found a loaf of bread. Food for Kurt's family. Kurt, wie schön dich wiederzusehen. Dieser Krieg. Zumindest wurde Jonas anständig begraben. Dank dir, Kurt. Jonas hat uns vielleicht verlassen, aber deine Tochter ist noch bei uns. Diese Pflanze könnte helfen. Koch sie in Wasser und gib Blut, sie den Sud zu trinken. Entschuldige mich, Kurt. Ich möchte allein sein. Viel Glück, mein Freund. Now I could take care of Lucy. I could work on my plan for Harry. It was then Kurt showed me his plan. Seemed like he wanted to build a balloon. At the time, I had no idea why. A real hot air balloon. And he wanted my help. Come in, Harry. I sure hoped Kurt knew what he was doing. Alles kommt wieder in Ordnung. Kommst du nicht rein? Und hier gibt's nichts für dich. Was machst du hier? Raus hier! Hey Kurt, geht's dir gut? Du weißt doch, du kannst hier nicht rein. Kein Kämpfen mehr. Keine Waffen. Bitte, lieber Gott. Hast du ihn gefragt? I couldn't believe Kurt still had that cat. She was a funny little creature. You could often see her on the rooftops, chasing birds, I guess.
Kurt, ich kümmere mich um die Uniform meines Sohnes. Danke. Hey! Moment, ich komme schon. Ich kann nicht glauben, dass von meinem Sohn nur noch eine Uniform bleibt. The inn opened its doors to the public. I knew Kurt was looking for a barrel. This was good timing. But would they let me in? I was the enemy after all. Krieg konnte ich immer schlafen. Das ist vorbei. Ich lasse dich nicht gehen. Oscar. Schön, dich wiederzusehen, Kurt. Du gehst nie wieder. Ich hoffe, Luzi geht besser. Ich mag mir gar nicht vorstellen, wie das so ja, ist, wenn man seine Kinder nicht beschützen kann. In Zeiten wie diesen. The innkeeper sure seemed good at talking, and Kurt gave him someone to talk to. The perfect distraction. Ich habe das von deiner kleinen Luzi gehört, Kurt. Hoffentlich geht's dir bald besser. Ich sagte, raus! Ich mag mir gar nicht vorstellen. Bin ich froh, dass ich keine Familie habe. Meine Gäste sind meine Familie. Du bist wie mein Bruder, Kurt. Ich habe das von deiner kleinen Luzi gehört, Kurt. Hoffentlich geht's dir bald besser. Der Sohn eines Mannes in Dornheim war auch krank. Er hat sich komplett erholt. Ich mag mir gar nicht vorstellen, wie das so ist, wenn man seine Kinder nicht beschützen kann. In Zeiten wie diesen bin ich froh, dass ich keine Familie habe. Remember, I had no idea what was going on. What use did Kurt have for a balloon? But whatever I said on the long walk home, Kurt's response was always the same. He pointed toward the sky. So that is what happened, Katrin. I took these things from the village. I made a plan to help the man who I believed to be a hero. To repay my debt for the time he saved my life. And for the time he sent Allied intelligence to help me. I wanted to build a balloon for him. I wanted to send him home. To set him free. soon as look at me. And I guess that's because of the stories I was told, you know? To folks back home, he would have been an evil Hun. But he was also a father. He was also a husband. And he was also my friend. I was too quick to trust the Canadian, too quick to call him a friend. I see now how foolish I've been. I see now 
I was wrong. But Kurt wanted to build a balloon, and I think he meant to build it for me. Something was wrong. My daughter didn't normally call out like that. She didn't make a fuss. Maybe there'd been an accident and he needed my help. It never occurred to me that I'd done anything wrong. It just never occurred to me. That is er. Das ist er. Das ist mein Sohn. Und du hast dieses Bild gemacht. Du warst dort. Ist er tot? Du Mörder. I was as surprised as Kurt. I didn't know who Max was. It's like the picture of his son triggered something in him. Flipped a switch. He could see it in his eyes. Before we knew it, he packed up early, went back to war, and took a bunch of my photos with him. Germany is interested only in its final push on the Western Front. They believe they can take Paris. I have not come here for Paris. By chance, I've been reunited with Franz. I haven't seen him since Vimy. Franz is built for war. Cold and detached, he sees the Tommy as vermin. I never used to understand him, but I do now. He will be a valuable ally. He has agreed to help me find the man in the picture. So that was it. Kurt left. Me? I resolved to build that balloon. I didn't know if I could do it without Kurt, but I knew I had to try. It was a long shot, but I didn't want to spend the rest of my life in Germany. And back home, there was Julia. <laughs> <laughs> 